Welcome again to Faith Over Fear for this day, and I pray that it's been a good day for you. Pastor John here. I, I want to I want us to think about why a Christian does what a Christian does. Why do we do what we do as a Christian? I'm thinking about the word duty this morning, and I'm wondering, do we do we serve the Lord with gladness, or do we serve the Lord out of duty? And there 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 is a difference, and that's what I want us to. Want us to think about. Now, here, here the statement. A preacher friend always said, "Salvation is more than being saved." Don't, don't take it wrong. It's true. It's, it's, it's a right statement. Salvation is. First part of salvation is coming to the Lord and missing hell. That's the most important thing. If, if you, um, if you get saved, and and don't do one thing for Christ the rest of your life. You still go to heaven. That's that. That's as Bible as anything is, and that can't be taken away from us. And praise the Lord for that, or or else we'd we'd be forever wondering if we're saved or not, if we're ready for heaven or not. But once we're saved, there's other things we need to do, like giving to the church, like praying, like Bible study, like visiting the poor, helping the needy, the, the different things. So with that in mind, and we, if we're honest. We have times when we just don't feel like doing things. We don't feel like going to the doctor, so we don't go to the doctor. <laughs> we, we don't feel like going to work, so we call in sick. We don't feel like going to a reunion, so we make up an excuse. We don't feel like dressing up, so we don't. Or we do those things. We go to the doctor. We go to work, we attend the reunion, we do dress up grudgingly, not because we want to, but because we have to. In 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 2, we read the words, preach the word, be instant, in season, out of season, reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. I, I contend that in every Christian's life, there comes a time when we must do what we what God wants us to do, even if we don't feel like doing it. It might be church attendance. You know, we we have a we have a ball game to go to in the afternoon, so we so we don't go to church. We we go to the ball game instead of going to church. We plan a visit on on Sunday morning, or do this on Sunday morning, or that on Sunday afternoon, so we can't go to church. Um, but. Sometimes we we need to do we need to do what we do for God even if we don't feel like doing it. That's when it becomes our duty. Now that's doing things out of duty because we feel we have to makes us obedient to Christ. It's not a fun place to be. I'd much rather serve the Lord with gladness. But again, we we all get there and sometimes we operate on the fact that it's it's our duty whether and we it's our um Another word would be uh, obligation. We feel like we're obligated, and we are. Once we get saved, there are certain things that God expects us to do. If we do them, he puts a smile on his face. If he doesn't, he uh, he uh, gets us. He gets back at us one way or another. He he uh, he does something to to let, let us know that he's still the boss. You see, it's it's better to serve because it's our duty than to not do it at all. It's a great thing if I do it and I'm just excited about it. I am just just can't wait to get up and go to church on Sunday morning. But then there's those times when it's raining and the rain hits the roof and it sounds real good and it's cold and you feel like pulling the covers back up and going back to sleep. But you know you're supposed to go, so out of duty, because you feel obligated, and we are, he says that we're not to forsake the assembling of ourselves together, just, to, just for that instance, we do it because it's our duty to do it. Let's make sure whether we do it, whether, whether we serve today because we do it because and be glad about it, or if we don't feel like doing it, but we do it because it's our duty, it is better to do it than to not do it at all. So as we go today, let's do what we do out of gladness, out of excitement, but if the, if the excitement's gone for today, we don't feel like doing something today, let's 
at least serving with, out of the cult of duty. So until we're together again, you make it a great day, and let's let's serve God, hopefully, prayerfully, with gladness.